Hey, what's up, boxing fans? Miguel Maravilla here with you. As you know, uh, Keith Thurman is off the card for the Prime PB. Uh, Prime. Uh, hey, what's up, boxing fans? Miguel Maravilla here with you, bringing you a recap of this breaking news as uh, Keith Thurman is off the Prime pay per view card. Now, uh, Sebastian Fondura will step in as he is slated to take on Tim Zhu. Yes, you got Tim Zhu and Sebastian Fundora headlining now. This is a very interesting fight. As we know, Thurman had been very uh, inactive for quite some time. And Zhu, well, he's coming off some big wins. Fundora, Fundora was already slated to be on the card. So this makes for an interesting matchup because anytime you have a, a late replacement and not just an, an not just any late replacement. You're talking about Sebastian Fondora. Yes, he has one defeat. However, um, that doesn't mean anything. Style-wise, this is very interesting. So we shall see what a difference uh, two weeks notice makes. Take a look. Going down next Saturday, March 30th at the T-Mobile Arena in Las Vegas. Live on Prime Pay-Per-View. Tim Zhu takes on Sebastian Fondora for the Towering Inferno. Sebastian Fondora with a record of 20 and 1, 13 knockouts from Coachella, California. He was undefeated his first 20 fights and suffered his first and only defeat last year at the hands of Brian Mendoza as he was stopped in the seventh. He was uh, slated for his return on the card, on this card against Sergey Bohachuk. However, with Thurman out with an injury, in comes Fundora to replace Thurman to take on the WBO champion, Tim Zhu. Tim Zhu with a record of 24-0, 17 knockouts, WBO champion, undefeated, Son of the legend, Costa Zhu. He has wins over Terrell Gachet and a uh, fight in which he was dropped but uh, prevailed to win. He also has wins over Tony Harrison. And he is coming off a unanimous decision win over Brian Mendoza. Now takes on former world champion Keith One-Time Thurman. What a fight this is going to be. This is one of these fights where you get two evenly matched uh, fighters. Uh, these guys are going to come at each other. I feel um, in this fight, you're going to have Zhu, very technical. You're going to have Thurman using his craft, using his experience in that ring. But this is going to be a very close fight. This, this fight can go either way. Again, on paper, it, it looks like anyone's fight. But I really like Tim Zhu in this fight. I feel Tim Zhu is uh, coming a long way. He is you know, very underrated. He's un not underrated, but under the radar when it comes to the, the PBC roster and, and everyone in that division at uh, 154. But uh, again, this is Tim Zhu's time to shine. And I expect him to be victorious in this fight. Uh, it's going to be, it's not going to be easy, but it will be a tough, difficult win for Zhu. Again, styles make fights. These two styles complement one another. I think we're in for a solid matchup. Uh, perhaps this even uh, enhances uh, the, the pay-per-view because uh, truly, I, I'm i not covering this fight specifically because I felt, well, Zhu's going to walk all over Thurman. Thurman has been inactive. However, with uh, Fundora on the card now, this makes it for a better main event, in my opinion. Uh, and on to the matchup. This is, uh, again, styles make fights. This is a very, very even matchup. Uh, I I like uh, this fight to uh, be a back and forth battle. 
Uh, I see uh, knockdowns being traded. I see the two guys making adjustments. And uh, this fight going the distance of possibly ending late. But I like Zhu to win in this fight. I feel he's the more powerful fighter. Uh, again, this is going to be an interesting matchup. Specifically because of the last minute switch. And it's going to be it's going to be a very interesting fight. You you will see